standing with your body in the position of a hybrid, but you've got the driver in your hand, right down the handle, two inches, you should feel comforted. This now is the shaft length for most of you that will take you to a realistic position and not drag you too far around. Hi everyone, Murdoch here. Hope you're well. Driver. Now, I want to talk in this video about how these longer drivers, bigger heads, longer shaft, designed for more distance. But I don't think they necessarily provide more distance for the senior golfer, for the weekend golfer, for someone that just plays once a week, basically. It's nice having a new driver, and I advise you to check your equipment, but you don't need to update every year to the latest. I want you just to sort of think about your striking capabilities before you worry about how far it's gone. So I want to talk in this video about you playing your driver, but grip it halfway down the handle. Take two inches off the top, all right? So you can see here, you might be gripping right here at the very end. Some of you, I've taught people and they're right at the very end. They haven't even got the whole hand on there. So just be very careful of that. We don't talk about this much, but I want to mention it now. I think it's a, a hidden gem. You put your left hand right in the middle. So basically you're going to make this driver more of a hybrid length. And immediately standing with your body in the position of a hybrid, but you've got the driver in your hand right down the handle, two inches, you should feel comforted. This now is the shaft length for most of you that will take you to a realistic position and not drag you too far around. The long shaft is very capable of dragging you too far and then issues will come. The weight will move to the outside. You'll turn the hip too much. You might straighten the right leg. So it's pulling you into a position where it's not going to be as consistent as perhaps where you are with a five iron and hybrid. I want the driver down the handle to pull you into that familiar position that you'd be in with a hybrid. Still set up with the ball position in the correct position, you might narrow the stance slightly to hybrid length or hybrid width. Put the ball just inside the instep, feel like you're behind the plumb bob line, behind the wall. All you've changed is down the handle. This, with a few practice swings, will then feel like your hybrid length swing. This is what I want you to do. I want you then to concentrate on striking out the middle. I want you to see how just improving your strike with the driver shortened will get you the extra distance that you're missing out on. Remember, these drivers are very much the same length. The ones you buy off the shelf, the new drivers, they're the same length that a pro will have. And you can see already how big their swings are, how long they are, how huge a shoulder turn they've got, how wide a stance they are. We're doing a shorter swing. So let's be realistic and have that club appropriate to the length of swing we have. I think that's going to help you, you know. Comment down below. Tell me how you get on with that. I want you to try 18 holes. Your next round, gripping down the driver two inches. Have a little practice first, because remember, you've got to feel like your body is swinging a hybrid. I want to see how with that extra control that you strike it better, you won't lose a whole lot of yardage. I think you'll gain some from better contact. But comment down below. Tell me how you get on. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you soon. Take care.